Hi, in this short tutorial, we will take a look at how a customer can choose to pay for an item in four equal amounts by using PayPal's Pay in 4 option. I have used the WP Express checkout plugin to set up my product and handle e-commerce transactions and you'll see the smooth transaction process for your customers when using this plugin in just a moment. When an eligible customer clicks a purchase button for a product or service you have created with the WP Express checkout plugin, they reside within an eligible country, the product price sits between $30 and $1,500, and you have completed the required setup for pay in for in your PayPal developer account, the customer will see the option to buy now, pay later for the item. Even though the customer will be paying for the item you sell in four equal amounts as a merchant, you will receive the total amount upfront from PayPal, of course, minus any transaction fees. This means that it only benefits the merchant to have this option available and ensures that there is no abandoned sales for high ticketed items as the customer has the ability to pay it off in four installments. Now that you know a little bit about what pay in four is and whether or not your customer base will be eligible, I'll jump onto my test website to complete a transaction where I choose to pay in four. I've now landed on my website so I can complete a checkout with the pay in four PayPal option to show you what it looks like for a customer who lands on your website and wishes to use this option. So if I land on this website and I'm hoping to use the pay in four option, I then click the purchase button. So in this case, it's a buy a baby bag button. And I click that and I'm then shown that nice pop-up window where I can choose to pay with my PayPal account. So you will need to pay with the PayPal account to see the pay in four option. It won't be shown for debit or credit cards there. So we click that pay with PayPal button. And from there, the PayPal payment window then appears where I will complete the transaction using either my PayPal balance in the majority of cases. But for this tutorial, I've decided that I'd prefer to pay this off in four installments. So I'll click that option and I can see there four payments of $24.99 due every two weeks starting today. So the first pay in four deduction from my account will be today and then I'll have three more every two weeks from today. So I'd like to pay in four and then I'll continue with pay in four. I'm only seeing this option because I am an eligible customer. So that means I reside in an eligible country and the product price is sitting between that 30 and $1,500. So because of that, I'm able to use that pay in four option. So I've got to agree to continue that one payment will be deducted today, followed by three consecutive payments every two weeks thereafter. So I can see there's no sign up fees, it's interest fee, and it has no impact on my credit score. So I'm happy with all those things and I click the continue button. So they just wanna confirm my info, all that is correct, I agree and I apply. So that's doing a quick application to see if I'm eligible for that pay in four. It's decided that I can use the pay in four option and I just need to click what I'd like those amounts to be deducted from. So we'll just choose the visa option and then I need to agree to the terms and I can click that agree and continue button down there to proceed with the payment. So it takes that little bit longer to pay in four, but it is still a very quick process for your customer. So I've been approved for the pay in four. That's great. Now all I've got to do is pay now. It's at this stage, if I need to, I can change my shipping addresses, although mine are correct for this item to be shipped to. So I'll click the pay now button from here. The WP Express checkout then directs the customer back to the thank you page. So I can see there that my transaction has been completed. For paying for customers, you might like to add a little note here that just reminds them that they will have multiple transactions withdrawn from their account if you're allowing that on your website. I haven't added that in, but if you wish to, just hop onto your thank you page. It's a simple WordPress page titled thank you, and you can edit that there. So that pretty much wraps up this tutorial on just showing you how a customer can very easily pay in four amounts, buy now, pay later. It's called pay in four by PayPal when you use the WP Express checkout plugin for WordPress. If you've got any further questions or queries about this tutorial or about pay in four or about WP Express checkout, don't hesitate to contact us.